Behold, this is Steve of Thousand Year Homes. Today's project is a door, the likes of which history has never seen a battle that just completed. And I didn't video any of it. But it was rage and power alone that makes the doors now to close properly. And I could have videoed it, but you wouldn't have seen anything other than a guy in uh, making it work. So not really a skill set that's transferable. But nonetheless, here we are. Let's finish this project right. Well, let's do a little carve in here. So I don't know if you can see it, but there's a little dust veil here where the uh, rubber fits. So I'm going to push this log in and give that like a half inch. So there's this, there's the seam there. I'm gonna give it a half inch. And what I'd like to do is for this to recess all the way in like a socket. So I might go way in on this. So I'm going to carve that out. <clears throat> How are we doing? How are you doing? That's pretty close. If I had a big post, I stuck it in there. See, I'm off just a smidgen. That's all right, because that'll be nice and tight. internet looky there internet just like I like it's made for it well because it was I don't know almost like it was made for it Very close. Very close. It's just so you can see and believe me. All right, so this is the one that I'm using as a test fit. And see, that's an eighth inch difference. Eighth inch. But I think I'll just sand that off and pound it in. Let's make that work. Make it work. Batteries are blinking on that camera. Let's see how close we are. So close. Let's do a little more. And let's do it on this side. internet looky there hand carved with a chainsaw 
I don't know. It's chainsaw. If, when you cut something with a chainsaw, is it still hand carved? Looky there. It's like precision fit. Precision. And I'm happy with that. I am happy. I'm going to get a, a log and pound it down and see if I can snug that up. And Now when I cut the other one, I've got to make sure that they're parallel to each other and that I don't end up with this thing going on. You know, with one of them being like that and one being like that. All right. Internet. Hmm. I'm going to carve a little bit more. That is one snug fit, though. Well, space aliens will come down and cut these so they just look perfect. Leah, I need you. Eh, hey, you've been saying that for an hour. Okay. I need you to, for me to eyeball that. So what I'm going to do, Internet, so that people think space aliens helped me build this house with this high-end precision. I'm gonna eyeball this alignment with that and make sure that these don't end up, you know, like, like that, you know, between this and that end. You see that end down there? Do you see it? Don't oh, come here, old Hank. So, but I need a second set of hands so I could step back, get a distance, and somebody's just taking their time. Old Hank, come here, buddy. Let's see if we can get Old Hank to come over. I'm going to find my shoes. I'm going to train Old Hank on how to hold a board. My shoes are in the truck. Oh, yeah, that's real good. Okay. All right, so <laughs> what I want, see that? That's part of the door jam right there. So what I don't want is the boards to look like this. Yes. Right? I need that. So, I'm going to use the Laser Precision NASA Calibrated Guide. Oh my gosh, you're so far off. Let me, let me help you out here, sister. We'll start. See that one down there? I want them both pointing at the same star in heaven. Getting close. Accept that as your truth. Oh, oh, you very smart girl. The uh, videos that I watch you guys doing this, they're getting out like antique ad <laughs> guides and scribing marks and, uh, you know, sharpening their marker tools so they don't, you know, they don't have the 16th worth of marker. And me, I do this. All right, See, my love. Now, you have this here, but it's, that looks like it should follow suit here. Okay? Perfect. Don't cut that one. Baby girl, we got this thing. We move. Get out of the way. All right. <laughs> if it's wrong, I'm blaming you. Hey, I tried to cut.
I let the videos get too long, they get hard to upload. Oh, hurt like All a right. glove. Woo, that is good. Yeah. All right, so you can imagine real post in there instead mm -hmm. of test post. Mm -hmm. Let me shoot down, see what the internet said. Wow, I think those are both. Are you stealing the little pieces? What? You, know, like, oh, you were in my shop. Oh. I don't even know if it's on. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go down. Let's go down. What are you doing, table? I was being a bitch, wasn't it? Little tiny thing. All right, I think we're there. Knock this guy off. I know. So, let's do that on video. That hammer is following that. Or let's hold these boards. They're a little longer. <clears throat> hold it down here. Yeah, like line one up. Like this? No, like this. And you eyeball that end, and I'll eyeball this end. Now, see, yours is crooked. You got follow this edge exactly. There you go. And then if I ran, imagine a door, because mm -hmm. if it's off, the door won't right. close right, right? Like this thing needs to be boom on. And I could get, you know, like if it's off a half inch, I could do that by drawing it up and putting it in a socket and making well, it right. if you cut this and it was just straight all the way, wouldn't it be easier? Well, I want the doors to recess in and close against the beam. Now, I don't know if they'll have that kind of clearance up there. I don't know. I. <laughs> but I thought I could carve out the door spot, which would be very yeah. hobbity. And then it would be in there. That's yeah. Right. yeah. That is okay, cool. but this looks good to me. Internet, you looking? That board and this board are very much the same, on the same plane. If I had a piece of uh, it looks like it, yeah. drywall, it would just right through here. All right. So then I need a third board here that runs for the uh, doors. This will be the other door uh, jam, mm -hmm. and then a window. Okay. So, but that's enough for right now. I'm gonna go ahead, I'm hungry. Let's go eat.